Hello, my name is Adam Bean, and today I would like to introduce a very, um, very useful um, Maven plugin called Visual EE, and to demonstrate to you how it actually works. I prepared a very little project with a boundary, uh, with injected hello control and um, an event. It's called um, CDI event. Then the control has an entity manager, and we have one entity called developer with one-to-many relation to programming language. And we have a listener on message which observes a string. So this one, um, this hello boundary emits a string and uh, the listener observes a string. And if I show, for instance, at the AHEX in Munich, uh, such a code, I got a frequent question. Well, uh, is it really hard? Is this decoupled? It's beautiful, but you know, is it really hard to debug or who, who, who is actually able to, 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 to emit such an event? And there's a really nice plugin, Maven plugin called uh, Visual EE. So this is um, Visual EE uh, from GitHub. And to make it work, we ha only have to copy uh, this piece of code. And I will go back here and um, introduce it. As you can see, it's your standard Maven project. It's actually created by my, by my um, our, um, own archetype. And I would use here the plugins and put it here. And now I will only build the project. So clean and build. And as you can see, there was an, already an input uh, output visual EE folder here. And it created in the uh, visual, visual EE folder in the root, a lot of um, HTML code. So what I would like to do is to um, view the project in a browser, as you can see, uh, there's lots of options and all classes is the easiest possible one. And what you see right now is the following. Developer has one-to-many relation to programming language. And the message uh, listener observes a string and this string is, uh, is fired by the hello boundary and the hello boundary, um, uh, hello control is injected in hello boundary. So here's nice visualization with uh, filtering options. So I could just search for string and you will see uh, the string with related dependencies. And uh, yeah, a really useful plugin. And um, yeah, uh, now you get us uh, some homework. If you, if you think the um, plugin is useful, just start the developer. I think um, it, um, he deserved it, uh, Thomas and start a developer and use it in project. It's really fast, so actually using my project, it generates really quickly a lot, all the dependencies. The only problem is the browser then, so if you generate too much, so you have to restrict this, but it's actually possible. So, um, thank you for watching, and see you one of upcoming conferences, workshops, or even air hacks at um, Airport Munich. So, thank you, bye.